Hey loves, it's Brianna. Welcome back to my channel. Make sure you hit that red subscribe button if you're new. You're gonna clean my car with me today. It has gotten to filthy, disgusting, dirty level again. We just got back from a family road trip. We were in the car for over eight hours each way. And I joke sometimes I'm a stay in the car mom because there are just some days when we go from preschool to therapy to other appointments, we have to eat lunch in the car and it's just turned into a disgusting, disaster, filthy mess again. So get ready to clean with me. Click the thumbs up if you like these car cleaning videos on my channel and let's get started cleaning up. First thing I'm doing, if you're going to clean with me today, I am getting rid of all the trash and debris around the interior of the car. And I sorted the items into two piles, the stuff that's gonna go back into the house and then the stuff that will go back into the car. But mainly, I had a ton of trash I needed to clean up because my daughter, Presley, decided to throw all her snacks around the back seat when we were on that eight hour road trip. So I had a lot to clean up and throw away. And the level of crumbs was outrageous and if you're new here don't forget subscribe follow along on my socials i'm at bits of brie and my blog is bits of brie blog.com i think she just like dumped all of her snacks like, i don't think she ate any snacks we gave her. they're literally just all over the seat like And then we call this the trunk, but I learned in London it's called the boot. But if it's something different in your country, let me know. But I just needed to straighten up the trunk a little bit. It wasn't too bad today. If you watched my car cleaning video from the fall, I had gotten a hay bale to decorate and it exploded in the back. So that was a real mess to clean up. But if you need more inspiration, you can look up some of my last few car clean with me videos. Just type Brianna K car clean in the YouTube search bar and you'll get to see they're always a disaster to clean up. But I do hope that this car clean with me video helps you get your car in order. If you're kids, you just know you are always having to clean your car. And I know that spring and summer can bring lots of road trips or just getting out and about a little bit more because you don't have snow and cold. So I hope this inspires you to make your car nice and clean today and that you enjoy cleaning with me. In one of my other car cleaning videos, we had a guess of how many water bottles there were in the car. This time, let's guess how many socks Presley has taken off and chucked that I found in my car. I'll come at the end. Now that all the trash and garbage is cleaned out, if you're cleaning with me, I'm taking my mint glass cleaner and wiping down all the interior windows, starting in the back. Basically, I'm gonna do a top to bottom wipe down of the interior windows and surfaces before I vacuum the entire car. And I'm using a car interior cloth I found at Target to wipe down all of the surfaces. It's very thick and it's designed to pick up more dust than a regular microfiber cloth. And I'm also using the geranium scented multi-surface spray today and it made the car smell so fresh and clean, but not too overpowering because in a contained space, you don't really want anything that's super overbearing. Um, and I also started using the Refresh Your Car Essential Oils collection. I really like the lavender scent. It's very, very calming and peaceful. So I have the little diffusers on my vents and hanging from my rear view mirror one of those as well and I love the it's like a very relaxing lavender scent Just keeping going here with the same method, cleaning down the windows, then cleaning the surfaces with multi-surface spray.
And now I'm just doing the inside of the windshield with that same mint glass spray and then wiping down the dashboard and the seats with the multi-surface spray. And seriously, it smelled amazing. Now that the interior surfaces have been wiped down, I've got my Dyson cordless vacuum and I'm using the mini spin brush attachment to vacuum all of the carpeted parts of the interior, starting with the trunk. I seriously love seeing the vacuum lines. Does anybody else feel this way? I just, I feel like it's so satisfying and just makes me feel so much better. But I love this vacuum. I'll make sure I link the model that I have in my description box in case you're interested. I did get a shop vac and I used it in my last car clean with me, but I honestly like using this one better because it's cordless and I feel like it's easier to clean all of the crumbs and food out that clearly my kids trash the car with. <laughs> Thank you. 
Now for the narrow creases in the seat and to get into the cup holders, I changed the attachment on that Dyson to the very narrow one, and that helped suck up all the little crumbs and gunk that were in the cup holders. I did then spray some of that Geranium Multi-Surface Spray into the cup holders directly just to do a good wipe out and make sure that they were extra clean. I also wanted to do an extra wipe down of some of the harder to clean areas around the seats and doors, so I'm using that same multi-surface spray. All right, time for the moment of truth. How many socks has Presley thrown off that were in the car? Let's see. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine socks. We could free nine Dobbies, you guys. And I'd love to hear from you guys if you have three or more kids, if you have any car recommendations. We're hoping to add to our family and I'd love to know what type of vehicles you would recommend that are easy for car seats and getting kids in and out of the car. Let me know. And in the back seat by the kids, I did not like how many crumbs were still in those crevices, so I got the vacuum back out and sucked them all up with that very narrow attachment piece. Okay, so the car is finally clean again. It smells so much better, and I just love how the vacuum lines look too. It's like so satisfying to look down and see the vacuum lines in the carpet. I really do. I love that new Dyson handheld. It just honestly makes jobs like this because it's cordless so much easier, and I was just kind of changing out the two different heads. There's like a bunch, but I had like the skinnier ones to try to get into like the cracks and like grooves of the seats, and then I just used the larger one for like in the trunk and over the mats on the floor but I hope that you guys liked this car clean with me video make sure you click the thumbs up if you did let me know in the comments if you have any requests for things you'd like to see me clean next and I will see you in my next video thanks for watching bye loves